Hi guys, welcome back to SQL Junction dot in. This is Srikant. This is continuation video of our last video that is parameter snipping part one. Last video we have seen the this query basically select star from start test where equal to equal to one. Okay, uh, we have executed that query and we have observed that the s the actual number of rows are 9999 rows fine then we move to the execution plan section and there we have the execution plan okay let's study the execution plan so basically table scan is happened okay fine because we have the 10000 records and we are retrieving 9999 so might be table scan is the best option yeah right table scan is the best option here in this case correct so now let's move to the understanding the actual stats so basically here we need to focus on the estimated number of rows here it is telling me that the estimated number of rows are 9999 then we need to see the actual number of rows so actual number of rows are 9999 it means the estimated number of rows and the actual number of rows are equal it means the plan estimation is right okay now come to the left side and click on the property section here we need to observe one extra section called as a parameter list let's expand it when we expand parameter list we need to see the diff, uh, two more columns they are the parameter compiled values and the parameter runtime value basically it has parameter compiled and the parameter runtime name itself suggests what does it mean when the plan was created what was the value we have passed to that particular query and what what is the value we have passed to execute that particular query this time so it is telling me that this plan was created for the value equal to one and this value uh, was having the equal to one that is execute this time also we have passed the same right okay great now what we are going to do we are changing one to two and running this query when we run this query what will we see we will see that there is a uh, output of only one row right and let's move to the execution plan section and we'll see here table scan is happened but a basic scan should not happen okay for one row basically okay let's come to the table scan operator and see the statistics of it basically when we see the statistic of it what we need to focus we need to focus on estimated number of rows the estimated number of rows are 9999 right but when we come to the actual number of rows we'll see only a one it means what the estimation is telling me a number which is far bigger than the actual number of rows so this for this particular query and this is this call this this cause performance issue right now just come to the left and click on the properties of it what will we see we need to focus on the parameter list section here and let's come to the here and let's see the parameter compiled value when the plan was created what was the compiled value at that time the value was one and when the plan was executed this time what the value and the value was two it means the compiled value and the runtime value are different okay that's why we are seeing the statistics difference so we are seeing the estimated are bigger that is 9999 and the actual number of the rows are one this is called as the parameter snipping so it is using the used plan basically existing plan it is not creating a new plan for the different parameters using a old parameter so uh, this is what about parameter snipping in the next video we will talk about how to resolve the parameter snipping issue hope you like our second video thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe and share our video have a great day